if you have a PDF file, okay, you can insert that one in, in, inside Tecla structure. But again, you must take note that the PDF, PDF file must be a uh, vector, a vector uh, type of the PDF because there are some PDF which is a, a raster. That one, we cannot do anything about the raster because that one is just a scanned copy or just a JPEG inside the PDF. But the, the PDF file that we usually import inside Tecla structure is more on the... Uh, it's more on the uh, vector, vector type, all right? So I have an example here. So look, if I go back to my menu and then import, you can see here, insert PDF, okay, insert PDF. So I can uh, browse for the PDF file. So I have a sample here. Uh, let's say this one. Standard drawing. So this one has uh, 25 pages, a PDF file. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, select only one of 25 and then uh, click OK. And then pick the position where you want to insert the PDF. So this option will insert the PDF, but basically what the Tecla structure uh, is doing is something like it uh, behind the scene, it will convert to DXF. So this one will become a DXF file now here, DXF, and then insert that one in Tecla structure. So meaning here you can now uh, rescale this. So if you have this one is a uh, 12,000, if you measure this one, you will find, uh, okay, this one is 119, so meaning, if I uh, uh, if I change the scale this of this one to one hundred, and then modify, so this one must be in the uh, near to the scale that we want to. So okay, look, uh, measure, and this one. So now this is the warning. Uh, in in PDF, the difference between the PDF and AutoCAD, uh, the, of course, the AutoCAD is much more accurate, right? The PDF, uh, you can use this one for your reference, but you cannot you cannot rely on the uh, the dimensions that you will get here because the dimensions here are uh, when you rescale this one, it will not go to the exact dimension. So as you can see here. It, instead of uh, 12 meters, it will be 11 meters and 999.38. So it's not exactly what you uh, get here. So let's say from here, if you measure, see here, 6776, but this one is 6777, the actual. So you can just use this one as your uh, reference only, but you cannot use this one to, uh, to snap on the line. Okay, so that's the drawback on using the uh, PDF file. So it's still uh, recommended to use the, uh, the AutoCAD or DWG file to, to insert in Tecla structure as your uh, reference, okay? Uh, the except, yes, you can insert, but the drawback is the, uh, the scale will not be perfect, similar, uh, I mean, like uh, what we have in in AutoCAD.